Hello everybody, welcome to the Chalice quarterfinal. Um, we've just caught them in time. It's K-Fog with blue Dark Elves up against Bright with red Pro Elves. And uh, they didn't have much of a break in between their Blood Bowl Super League game and then they're back out at it. Um, Bright has a crazy one-turn guy here. Movement 9, add 1 plus. Sprint, sidestep. Very, very nice blodge. Very nice catcher. And uh, he's also got a wizard. Because his team his team value is somehow ridiculously low. I don't really understand how his team value is so low. But it is. And uh, he's got 12 players. Apo. Incredible stuff. And uh, Big Kev has got, you know, like a very nice Dark Elf team. So, yep, yeah, that's, that's how it looks. Uh, there isn't a sneaky get dirty player on Bright's team, right? He's got a dirty player there, but doesn't have a sneaky git. Whereas Kfog does have the dirty player that's sneaky. Um, so yeah, that's that's the game. Wow, that's that was swift, wasn't it? I don't know if like Bright's got like loads of doubles or what, but it's uh, it's kind of wild how good his team is. To say that he's getting a wizard versus everybody as well. <laughs> He's got a one turn on a wizard is a pretty good combination. Oh, he's got a wizard. Wait, why is playing pearls? He does have a wizard, yeah, it's crazy, isn't it? Crazy. Like, it doesn't even look a bad team. It doesn't look 150 TV down. No. So. I mean, is that rookie? Oh, no, it's a blodge bit somewhere. So. Oh, he's got a double move up catcher as well. Oh, no, that's not double. That's an edge and move up, isn't it? Yeah, even more expensive than a double move up. Can't have double move, can they? Yeah. yeah. How many? Oh, only one bench. Only one bench. Yeah, it's it's kind of mad. Yeah, it's been off straight away. <laughs> oh god. And was it doubles on the armor? I think it was. It was a sneaky get would have saved him. And he just got a stunner as well. Diced. Perfect start for Capo. Yes. Um, yeah. Oh, he's juggling on witches on the wrong side. Oh. What's going on here? I swear K5 had like a mighty blow pit, so. Mm, that might have been like last season. <laughs> oh, the oh Dupler skulls. Oh, he's got four rerolls. Yeah, it's a great catcher, isn't it? Really great. Like, really, this is really good team, I think, from Bright. The fact that he's getting a wizard versus everybody with it is mad. Yeah. Genius. So I guess he's just got, like, loads of double, uh, like, loads of randoms. Now he's got a tackle, wrestle, catcher. Whoa. Big pal. Mm. No AV ups on it. Oh, he's got. Yeah, Bright's got no AV ups, has he? No. K Fog's got one. And he's going to foul the one turner. Oh, he's I'm, failed the dodge. Re-roll re -roll it. Re -roll he it almost has to. 100%. Not even. Oh, why is he even thinking about it? Oh, my God, he didn't do it. <laughs> what if he died? What if he died? What if he died? <laughs> I guess, like, because um, the pro elves don't have their dirty player. Oh, look, look, rage crit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> no, I can't be demoted, demoted out of my own league, my own mind, but no. Um, Oh, that's one. That is one privilege that I get. I will always be in it if I want to be in it. You actually demoted me. He he messaged me off stream and was like, "Yeah, I'm sorry, Dim. You've got to go." That's yeah. true. Yep. Uh, that's true. I I didn't I didn't perform well enough, so uh, 
he's taking my spot. Yep, yep. Mankes will be in next season to replace Dimmy after Ooh. Dimmy's underperformed. <laughs> Bit of a downgrade, you know, but uh, I'm sure the Super League will survive. <laughs> <laughs> Euro Bowl MVP and the two-time Welsh champion, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, he hasn't won OCC 5A. So. He hasn't, has he? <laughs> yeah, no. There you go. I don't know where Jim's getting these people from, honestly. <laughs> you can put him in his place with that one, didn't he? Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, yeah, I can't, can't complain about that, eh? Top of uh... To the the best record if you take away head to head and just do it on points and touchdown difference. So well done, dude. Yeah, I'm not the worst player in Super League anymore, am I? Uh, no, no, not by a long way. It's it's hard to miss now. <laughs> yeah, I used to be. I like that's the best thing is I'm not the worst player in BBSL history anymore, yeah. which I, I was for a while, wasn't I? <laughs> you, you were for a while. Then then Chunter beat you, and then now Art has beaten has beaten both has beaten well has beaten you. He hasn't no one. Oh yeah, no. I guess he is. He, yeah, I guess he's worse than Chunter as well because Chunter's done two seasons, hasn't he? So I, I imagine. Won a game for him, yeah. Yeah, I imagine Art is complete bottom of Super League now. <laughs> Which is funny, isn't it? Because I don't think he's the worst player to have competed in it. But he does. Yeah, have the I worst was record. definitely. I'm definitely the worst player. No. Actually, I don't know. I don't know. There's one other guy that. Yeah, there's there's been a few that Historic, been historically beat Jimmy quite a lot. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Not gonna mention any names. No, I don't think you have to now, Jimmy. I think you basically <laughs> have named. There was a few. There was a few that like you know would have made it more like streamers. The first few seasons made it more streamers, yeah. and it was only Blood Bowl three, with uh, with Blood Bowl three like with having the World Cup ticket. Thought I've got to make it the best of the best, and not play favourites. So that's why it's Dimmy and not. Uh, <laughs> Not anybody else. Hey, well, hey, hilarious. <laughs> Sorry, it's true I mean, though. It's I mean, it's true. Finished, finished, fucking second. There you go, joint top. Can't in the complain. semi-final, mate. Yeah, in the semi-final. Play the best player in the world tomorrow night. You know, so. Highest ranked NAF player. Best player in the world. Highest ranked NAF player. <laughs> Euro Bowl champion. champion. No, I won't Highest ranked NAF player. Until I'm and victorious. And Euro Bowl champion. I will defend. Yeah. I will defend. Probably two time or three time Euro Bowl champion? I don't know. I don't know. They didn't win it last year. Last year the Danes won it. Did they? Yeah, and then I think the five before that was like England. Mm. Because there was like a two year gap. So I think it was like France this year. Oh, World Cup winner though. Yeah. I think they won the World Cup. France. Did they? Was Olivier on that team? Yeah. L Lazez, wasn't it? L I'm pretty French. sure. I'm pretty yeah. sure it would have been him. Oh, mate, that's the dream to win the World Cup. <laughs> that's, that, I think that's my new goal in Blood Bowl. I mean, i got to take baby steps, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> first I've got to win BBSL and then the World Cup and then I can retire. There you go. Thank you very much, Randy <laughs> Thomas. Staying fantastic for 31 glorious months. Nearly eight who will be the pregnancies. I'll be retiring in 2027, obviously. Mm. Yeah, it's interesting, isn't it, the World Cup? I'd like to win the World Cup. In a way, it's Cup, easier I, I to win the World, World Cup than the Euro it's Bowl, not, isn't it? It's not. In a, oh, it, what, because the teams are bigger, so you've got less variance, yeah. Well, you you can you can choose your team so <laughs> more, right? You've got more control yeah. over your team. You can choose your team. The team mm. is also bigger, so you can like if you've got the right team and they're all really really good, like you're more likely to up. But you compete in against two thousand people, whereas in yeah, Europe you compete against like two hundred. But then, hmm, how much difference does that make? I don't know. I think it makes quite a lot. Yeah. That's I mean, nine games out of six, good. isn't it? It's nine games out of six. Yeah, yeah. So I mean, it depends go, like, on your teammates, doesn't it? It depends on your teammates. Ones, the right. thing is, right, this is the thing, Dimmy, right? For you to win for you to win Euro Bowl, you'd have to do I it with like, the... you'd have to do I it, Dimmy, could... with Purple Goo and Pete W and uh KFO so. and four other people, right? Whereas to win to win uh, the World Cup, you could do it with uh, Man Case and Olivier Dulac <laughs> and, and, and K Fog, and you could just handpick five other people to do it with, couldn't you? 
Yeah. Uh, because they have to, chicken. They have to because they the Euro Bowl is invite. It. They have to have an yeah. open competition at the same time. It's why Home Nations has an open as well as the Home Nations mm. because it's a NAF ruling that you can't have a invite only tournament that's NAF sanctioned or something. Yeah. yeah. They're calling it the Six Nations now, aren't they? Because they're going to have uh, France and Spain what, as Italy? well. France and Italy. Oh. I thought it was France and Spain, but it could be France and Italy. Well, no, I'm only saying Italy because Italy are in the Six Nations, like rugby, right? right. Not, not because because Spain aren't in the Six Nations. <laughs> I think I, is, I so, thought it was France and Spain, but it could also be France and Italy, couldn't it? I, don't uh, know. I think it's Malta, isn't it? It's Malta. That was last Spain. time. But this time they said they're adding France and Spain. I think it was Spain. Man, if they've got France in there, that's going to be like legit. Mm. I just want to. I I really want to play French football. I don't know why, but like, <laughs> yeah, just play French people. Putting them on the pedestal, aren't you? That's what you're doing, do you? Well, yeah. They do. I honestly, like Olivier comes across like so well in every interview thing I've seen. Yeah, he did. He seemed a lovely fellow. Uh, and wop, yeah, and got a lot of love for that guy. Mm. Good guy. Meow. <laughs> How fast did that player move? Like, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I've noticed they seem more speeded up now. Like it, the uh, the mummies does not like. I did it. Tried to recreate it with a mummy, and it just didn't work. But sometimes they just go insanely fast. Now it's. I don't know why. Or how to recreate. <clears throat> Oh, 100% go to France for you, chicken. Oh, talking of leaving minis behind, wasn't it funny that Soul left his minis in America and then left them in Greece as well? <laughs> yeah. yeah, that was incredible. <laughs> oh my God. That's what I, I used to be like. I used to just lose everything. <laughs> This is quite good that he's got completely behind Big Kev, but he's it's got the turns to put to. Yeah. Uh, I imagine Kefo's going to at least get a two turn out of this at some point. Well, maybe we're going to see a rinse and repeat of the last game, but on the opposite end where Bright scores early and then uses the wizard to turn him over and beat 2 0 up at half time. Yeah, yeah. It's a possibility, isn't it? I mean, Stalin's just well dangerous in this matchup. It is. Hon, hon, hon. Hon, 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 hon. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully all the French guys don't think I'm a complete asshole with a hon, hon, hon thing <laughs> and just realise that it was all I, I don't to be think that would be the. I don't think that would be the reason they think you're an asshole, Jim. Wow, Tim. <laughs> I mean... Wow. <laughs> a, I'm a lovely fellow. I know, you are, you are to me. I love you. I, I, I think so. You're a great guy. New massive bell end. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Timmy. <laughs> That's lovely of you to say. <laughs> Thanks, Game of Vision. <laughs> <No. laughs> Timmy <Timmy's laughs> stole his toxicity. I just, I just existed. I just existed in that game. <laughs> I just pulled the Gadanic. Mm. Or the Haymay, I see. Yeah, he did. Yeah, yeah he, he said did. bye now. He said bye now when he left. And he had left, unfortunately. And he said bye now. I am here. Yeah. Oh, he's back. <laughs> I'm really trying to not be toxic now anyway. And I mean I don't think I was toxic, but I can see how some of the things that I said were taken the wrong way and 
how some things I did were bad, so I'm trying to be good. I think toxic I, is like I, the most overused bullshit thing ever though. I still maintain that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, all these guys, this is a bit of a mistake from Big Kev, wasn't it? Allowing him to reconnect over here. Maybe it wasn't, maybe he thought. Oh, I think he's just trying to, he's just trying to bang, isn't he? Like, yeah. He's, he's trying to max bangs, which is fair, right? Because with a wizard, I think his best shout of winning this is just by banging him out. So. Yeah. I didn't bully Chunter off Twitch. What a thing to say, Mordred. That's not true at all. Is it? That's is it not, it's not true at all. <laughs> is it true? Oh my god. That's not true at all. That's so untrue. It's outrageous. Chunter just got burnt out, didn't he? Because he fucking plays a million fucking games all the time. I mean, BB3 ladder is not the most fun experience on the planet. I mean, BB's not <laughs> the most fun no, experience on no. the planet most of the time. But... That's a high standard you're holding it to there, Dimmy. <laughs> yeah, no video yeah, yeah. game's gonna, uh, gonna compete with that. But, uh, yeah. I mean, like, the reason I haven't been streaming is just because it's like, I, d I just don't really have a reason to play Blood Bowl 3 outside of BBSL, which I'd rather just concentrate on. Um, and having said that, while I've been concentrating, I've just been using zombie ball carriers every game. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, like every time I get a touchback, I just give it to some random guy and blitz someone over <laughs> in a completely opposite corner with no block. But, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> Yeah, it's like I wouldn't like. I just couldn't stream like a ladder run because it's just not. It's not a fun experience for me. Yeah. No, yeah, that's well. That's why I thought about doing you know the race guides and then like the twenty games with them, so that like I'm just focused on the making content rather than the uh, trying yeah. to qualify or anything. That's a good KO. Yeah, very nice. They've got some pressure here. Maybe we see a score. He's got. Tackle any on with the tackle. Oh wow! Oh. I think he will re-roll this because I think he wants to get in the way now. Got a side step of there, side step with tackle on the ball, and then maybe he's got some of these in as well. How many re-rolls has he got two left? Probably want this one in here, right? And that one can G5 foul. So yeah, I think this one. I'm surprised he punched. Honestly, I'm surprised he punched there. I like not punching. Um, I like dodging off this and this slotting this guy in here, right? That's what I like. Wow. He's not fouling guys, he's trapping him a little bit. Hmm. Interesting. Well, that lets him off, doesn't it? Super interesting turn. Do you believe that Mordred? Does anyone else believe that? I don't I don't think that. I thought Chunter thought it was good natured and uh, took it in his stride. Oh, I do the channel voice all the time. I'm sorry if it really pushed you off channel, if you uh, have watched this. Yeah, I, I'm sure I messaged him and he's like, no, it's fine. I'm sure, I'm sure. I'm sure. But he could have lied, couldn't he? he could have, it could have upset him and, and he could have lied and said that it didn't. But... Oh, he re-rolled it. Oh, he's Ooh. fine. That's two plus. Oh, it's, oh, that's, oh no, you just do two Dodge plus and then you jump over him. Yeah. Dodge oh, then jump God. over your own guy. Yeah, yeah. So I was thinking like, you had to dodge and then move into that square. Oh, oh he just jumped He dodged. No, he's he got diving jumped. tackle. And he's got diving tackle versus the jump as well. Oh, my goodness. What do you mean? Diving tackle, what, affects the jump? It affects jumps now, yeah. Oh, it's not leap. Right, okay. Oh, my goodness. Oh, it's because it's because he's edge one plus. So he thought it didn't matter because it was still a two plus, right? He thought yeah, it was yeah, still a yeah, two yeah, plus, yeah. but it became a four plus. So yeah, he, oh man, he got caught up by the damning tackle. Incredible. Okay, that's okay, then, my buddy. As long as as long as it was a joke. 
Because I didn't know if, like, you know, I didn't, I mean, he could have said something in private or whatever, couldn't he? I mean, he's streaming now, isn't he? I mean, that's the, that's the thing. Like, everyone needs a break from Blood Bowl sometimes, I think. It's, uh... Like, you see all the guys who bang out hundreds of games, like your Cautions, your, uh... <clears throat> Daedal Quists, your Chanters, your Eliods, your... Everybody, like, everyone who grinded out loads of games, they all... disappear for yeah. a while. Yeah. Burnout's kind of inevitable, isn't it? Yeah. And, like, honestly, I think, um... I don't think much of it is, I mean, some of it is like the the game and like the UI and all that sort of thing, but I, I think a lot of it is just the rule set. The, the, the progression in 2020 is nowhere near as good as 2016 or LRB or whatever it's called. Mm. For me personally, in my opinion, just to add all that <laughs> up, I'm not saying that's the case, but that's how I feel. Mm, interesting. It's just the like, you just pick your team, you like literally give them whatever you want and stuff. It's like the randos as well. I'm not sure I like the random skills. Mm. I don't like the saving up for whatever stat you want. I liked the, the random, and I, I hate the injury table as well where just everything's dead. Constantly. Yeah. He could have surfed, but the surf was costing him, right? Like, it, this was just a shitty line, and he doesn't care about surfing him. And then, so it's better that he, he gets a big, more, more away, right? It's better that he gets more away and uh, and further down the field against the threat of the wizard and stuff. Dark Elf team looks pretty incredible. Yeah, I'll tell you what, though, that what a, what a mistake by Bright, right? Like, he, he, he obviously forgot about the Diamond Tackle. Or didn't, didn't I mean, see I, I didn't even know what the, the icon yeah, was. Yeah, yeah, he might not have known what the icon was either, yeah. I had no idea. I was like, what the mm. hell? What the hell? Yeah, he might not have seen it. So it, 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 in being good at Blood Bowl hurt him because he knew his guy was a 1+, plus, so he didn't care about the tackle zone. So he just, rather than doing a 2-2, two, two, he just did a 2. But actually, he should have realised that that was a 3-2 instead of a 4. And then the 3-2 was, was worth doing. So, yeah. Wow. Oh, my God. Eurobowl dates confirmed as the 4th and 5th of October 2025, Jim. Do you know what that means? Oh my god, that's like our birthday. It's our birthday, Jimmy. Oh. Oh. We might have to go, Jimmy. Though I think I'm only going to the highest bidder. <laughs> I mean, like, I, I'm going to keep an eye on this rule set, I think. I mean, I'll still go. If someone plays my fights, I'll go. Simple as that. I'll pay you for I can't pay for your fights. You should put a beggar bar up and say, send Jim to Hungary. <laughs> send Jim to Budapest. Send Jim to Budapest. <laughs> then, then loads of people who don't like me can just be like, yeah, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, one way one exactly. Way. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Get the fuck off my Twitch screen. Fuck off to Budapest. <laughs> um, yeah. yeah. I quite like. I quite like the idea of being an actual freebooter and just going to whoever whoever pays the most. <laughs> yeah, well, tickets normally come out in like February, March time from memory mm. and then we'll have a rule like the rule set deadline is the end of the year mm. we've got england captain votes coming up so yeah anyone in chat who is a naf member who is english naf member and has played a tournament in the last 12 months you are allowed to vote for who you want to be the team england captain and it's mm. coming up very soon Mm. So make sure you vote for <laughs> my mate. <laughs> <laughs> let's not let's avoid all uh, accusations of uh, election rigging. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Vote for whoever you think is the best candidate. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, but, but if yeah, if you're English and you are an F member, you can vote for England captain, and it's coming up like at the end of the month, I think, or something like that. 
Yeah, quite soon, I think, actually. Yeah, well, I think there's a, there's a thread on Talk Fantasy Football about it. Yeah, that tells you all the dates. Mm. Yeah. Because it's like a FAQ and stuff. Oh, he wrote, argued the call on a six. Look a dog. What a dirtbag. Look a dog, big cat. Talking of England captains, that was the England captain there, right? Uh, who, uh, yeah, Kevog. Kevog. Yeah, yeah Kevog was the England captain, yeah. And uh, yeah, so like the thing—the thing about going to Europe is you've got to like buy the ticket like seven months in advance, haven't you, or whatever. So I'm not on a team, and then uh, you know, so like I just can't do it. Yeah, right? but yeah. But so I've really like... got no choice but to go to free, but I can't play for England because of the England charter. So no matter who becomes captain, they just—they're not allowed to pick me. So that's well, that's you silly. You unless they change Europe, the charter, yeah. they could change the charter to pick me, I guess. Um, but yeah, that's gonna no, I don't think it's going to happen either. But you know, they could surely if they've made it, they could change it. Um, but surely. I'd play for England. But I mean, yeah, as far as Europe goes, like I'm not going to fucking buy a four-man team ticket, am I? Seven months in advance, that's mental. So well, no, you work out who you want to go with now, <laughs> and then when it comes up, you've all paid a quarter of it, right? Yeah. You don't do it. You don't just buy a ticket and then. I mean, to be fair, I bought a ticket for Kent Team Championship, and I'm just waiting for the other guys to pay me whenever they want to. Yeah. Well, one of them paid me, but it's yeah, it's like. It's, yeah. I mean, someone's got to buy it on the day because it'll sell out. So either you need the no, money no, you before it's done. No, no, you don't buy it on the day. So like. Ah, you just put your you name register, down. Yeah, yeah, and then they'll sell out, and then you've got like a month to pay them or something. Ah. So that's what happens with NFC anyway. So like with NFC, you have to put your name down on the Google. UK sheet. TC, you mean? No, 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 NFC, NAF Championships. All right, so, but that, that's not a team, though, is it? So. Oh right, okay, yeah, yeah, but like, okay, I think it's the same thing with UKTC then. But I don't know. I've never captained UKTC. Right. Um, like, but yeah, like for Ken, when I was captain, I just bought the ticket for everyone, yeah. and then got the money back off the team. But, but, you, but you I didn't have to. No, no, I didn't have to. Like, so as as far as I'm aware, with Eurobowl, you just you put your name down and then you find out that you've got a place like a week later or something right and then you've got like a month to pay it okay well that, that seems a lot better then yeah okay yeah it's something like that okay so i could try and get a buy a ticket get my name down then sort out the team and get the money and then do it okay so that's that's okay then right uh, that makes things a lot better thank you dimmy for that information that actually makes sense if i thought about it i could have probably worked that out myself couldn't i but yeah, yeah that is a good yeah. way of doing it yeah because you like you have to put your name down and then you don't know where you are in the lists. So like, because mm. <laughs> they said to us, oh, you can go on the waiting list because it was already fully allocated. And then I said to Hancock and Sick as Eggs, I just went, I'm not going to go on the waiting list and then get told a month before that I've got to drop a grand. Do you know what I mean? So yeah. I can't afford to do that. So. If only catchers weren't shit at throwing, you could just bolt him and then this catcher could get it and like long bomb it to the blitzer. <laughs> and then he could have handed it off to this guy. Like it's ludicrous that that's how it worked. Now he can yeah, he can five GFI to hit the two D the ball. Which is alright. Oh diving tackle again. Roll the three. A shadowing, isn't it? Oh shadowing, shit. Yeah, shadowing. Yeah, it is shit, Jim, yeah. <laughs> yeah it is. We got oh, on, oh no, oh, he's got reroll. Gets a full oh, pow. pow. He's got no one who can pick it up though. No. Hasn't he, hasn't he used all his movement? He's an armor break and a scatter catch. Really. Oh, worst possible scatter. Yeah, no, he's got no one who can even get near. But if he like if he could <laughs> pass, he could have bolted it, right? Like that's what that's what I meant. Like if 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 he could cast, if he could have passed, he could have bolted it, and then picked it up, lobbed it to the other one, and then handed it off to this guy and, and score. But even that wouldn't have been different. Plus, they'd have all changed. If they'd have all played differently if elves could pass. <laughs> yeah. So, oh, he's on the diamond tag. I mean, all I'm all I'm seeing here is dark elves are better than pro elves, right? So, yeah. I mean, like, the AV is huge. 
No, I mean, there's a bit of luck, though, for Big Kev, right? A lot of luck that, uh, that oh, Bright realised he was Adj 1 plus, but didn't realise about the diving tackle. Um, so that was the perfect storm for him to fail that dice roll. Otherwise, he would have banged it in. And then if he banged it in, maybe use the bolt to, or the zap or the fireball to go 2-0 up, right? So, who knows? Or the bubble box, glorious. I think he just wants to smash the catcher, doesn't he? Oh, yeah. That too. <laughs> that too. Can he surf it? He might be able to surf it with... Yes. With uh, yes. Well, not even with dice rolls, I think. Oh. No, gee, if I, no that's not right. Yeah, oh, he needs to fill three more squares. Yeah, no, he, can't, he couldn't fill that many, could he? No, no, he couldn't do it. I mean, he could be geophires and dodges. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but he wasn't going to do that, was he? Oh, it just serves him anyway. <laughs> Easy game. Easy. He's got a reroll, so he probably should block with block, but it's hard to get an assist. Just score. Blocking without blocks too risky. Oh, oh my god, rolls a one. Four. So great half for Big Kev. And now that lets him play around the wizard by just scoring as quickly as possible, doesn't it? Or as safely as possible against the wizard. So really, really nice for Big Kev. He'll probably like keep the ball back with a couple of players. And then, like, do you know some kind of weird handoff play to try and get it to bypass the wizard completely? I imagine. Will Bright see the uh, art sweeper in his end zone? <laughs> Looks like he hasn't yet. Because from his point of view, right, he'll be like this probably. <laughs> There's a danger he forgets this guy. No, he's found him. Well played, Bright, well played. Guess what I'm getting tomorrow, Jimmy? Uh, tub of Hagen Das. Oh, I haven't had a, I haven't had ice cream in a while. I, uh, I watched a video about sugar and I, uh, it put me off ice cream. Yeah, yeah, it's not good. No, it's not good. It's sad. All the good things are sad. And um, now I'm getting the new chores tomorrow. Oh. Box set. Whoa, hey. And I'm getting, I'm getting a box of Pro Hills, actually. Oh. Oh yeah. And a box of Amazons. Flip me, Jimmy. And a box of all. <laughs> Jesus. Is there anything you're not getting tomorrow? <laughs> we'll get four teams. Four, <laughs> four teams tomorrow. Absolutely buzzing. Okay. I think I'm playing Pro Rolls next. Mm. Oh, actually, no, there's a tournament before that, but I don't think I'm going to paint anything for that. Mm. I might just paint Slam Team. Flipping Slam. Well, I haven't played him at a tournament yet, but I won the league, by the way. Uh, congratulations, me. Congratulations, uh, Dimmy. Official, I had full official, faith in you, I said. I didn't after game two. Oh, my God. I hadn't <laughs> won a game. And then random strip ball, and that was it. <laughs> Rest is history. Won every game since. Glory. In the league. Is that a pro? That's a runner, isn't it? Is that a dark elf runner? Yeah, so we can do a little cheeky pass. Just a rookie runner got, helps him with the two turns. He's got a rookie. A rookie? Fuck off! He's got a rookie runner. A rookie? Yeah. He's <laughs> got a rookie. Do you, uh, do you live near Hartlepool, Jim? Uh, vaguely, I guess, yeah. 
there's a team event in April called Monkey Bowl, I think. Mm. And it's a good one. And there's some good coaches going. Oh, yeah, somebody oh. sent me a message about something. Oh, is it a certain very good goblin coach? <laughs> subtle, Dimmy, subtle. Um, yeah, Monkey Ball, first weekend in April in Hartlepool. Yeah. Yeah. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, I didn't reply because I was busy commentating on Blood Bowl. Oh. Yeah, they hanged, uh, they hanged a monkey, didn't they, in Hartlepool? Why? Um, so, it was probably a grease monkey, right? On the, uh... What's a grease monkey? Oh, no, sorry, like a, a powder mechanic. monkey. Sorry, a powder monkey. <laughs> I just said the wrong I word. You meant like a mechanic. No, no, a gre it was powder monkey. It was probably a powder monkey. That was a thing, right? What's the powder monkey? Powder monkeys were little boys that worked on ships that, like, you know, reloaded the cannons and shit. Ah. And so it was probably a powder monkey. And then, but over time, it was like, you know, meant to be, like, cause he was a French, he was a French uh, boy, probably. And then over time, it, it, you know, transformed into this tale of, it was a literal monkey that they thought was a, a French spy because it was, <laughs> they thought the making monkey noises was French. <laughs> so that's oh that's what it's God. transformed in, over time, but in reality, it was probably an actual French powder monkey that they just you know murdered, even though he was a little boy. <laughs> Hello, an Orion. So there you go. <clears throat> that's mental. Mm. Yep. Hello, an Orion. Yeah, but if it's on your doorstep, mate, that would be a great tournament. It's supposed to be one of the best. Like, Pur Purple Goo said that was one of the best tournaments in England. Mm. Interesting. And I, I looked at it, but it's a lot of money for me. Mm. Oh, yeah, a long way for you to go, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, Budapest is closer. <laughs> 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 yeah, what was the bell? The Belgium was like forty-one pound for uh, for hammers. What the flight? Yeah, 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 yeah. Mental. Mate, the train from here to Hartlepool and back is one hundred and sixty-five quid. Yeah, you could go to Belgium twice. <laughs> That's crazy, Four isn't times. it? <laughs> well, there oh, is back it there? Then. Forty-one is there. Yeah. That's oh, what I thought. Always yeah, he works in Belgium a lot of the time as well. Mm. Mm. Four, yeah, in our in, yeah, we've got, well, or three plus leader, right? It's uh, tight EVLs, isn't it? So they really want their rerolls to, uh, uh, to do things. This game is looking, looking kind of cooked. It's interesting, isn't it? I think, I think Kvog will keep his runner back, right? I think he'll split his team here into two into two groups so he's got like the receivey group and the yeah. don't get fireballed or you know killed group he might, he might he might still keep it in a big one but the problem is if you put it in a big one then it's like if the wizard works but then if you put a smaller group it's easy for the wizard to work it's tough isn't it can you just score on this guy this turn no he's too far away nah like you just score next time right yeah but how do you, do you bring up that he's bringing up the ball now so we're definitely going to wizard Definitely wizarding for Bright. Million percent. Unless he just goes back, he could he could try to run back. No, he's not. He's coming forward. A guy from Newcastle told you it was an orangutan. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, that's the legend, right? That it's like... It was I didn't realise it was a thing, yeah. Yeah, it's a pretty famous thing. But, but you know... The truth, supposedly, is that it was a powder monkey. Which makes a lot more sense <laughs> than the people of Hartleyville pe being so stupid that they think <laughs> a real, actual monkey is a French spy. There <laughs> <laughs> we go. Fireball. Yeah, probably fireball. It's not a great fireball, honestly, but... You 
just got to do it right. It was good. Goodbye, yeah. goodbye, oh. K four. Oh yeah. my god. Yeah, that was a bit unlucky. It was, it was, it was a, it was a bit of a shit fight, but it was a bit good from Big Kev to make it. Wait, he's got a stripper there, hasn't he? Mm. So you can strip it on a one D. Although it is a four plus dog. He's got a sidestepper here, hasn't he? So Maybe he's got a wrestler there, so you can put an assist in and wrestle him down. The problem is you've got to knock him down. You really have to knock him down because otherwise he sidesteps there and he's got diving tackle and he absolutely well, shits on you. He's got a wrestler, he? hasn't he? He's got a wrestler, hasn't Yeah, he? but he's, he's got to knock him down, that's what I'm saying. If he doesn't knock him down... Okay, he wrestles him. There you go, he's, he's wrestled him. Jim. Yeah, but he still had to wrestle him. Like, he was 55... He was only 55%, Jimmy. Look, right, right, it's never going to win anything with that <laughs> lack of positive mental attitude, Jimmy. You need to just have faith. He's going to wrestle him. It's going to be fine. And he's going to sidestep to there. here, isn't he? Here. Yeah, then we're going to get the scatter bounce off the blitzer. It's going to bounce off the wrestle guy and it's going to land in front of the catcher. No, 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 no. It'll, it'll bounce to him, bounce to him, bounce to him and he'll catch it and then he's got it on the thrower. Yeah, and then he can throw it to the catcher and then he can run down the field. Yeah, well, he can run, the, run down the field, then he can throw it to the catcher. It's the safer way. Here we oh, go. Not the strip, wrestle tackle. Should have gone with the strip. Should have gone with the strip, yeah. Full power. Oh, he starts it backwards here, isn't it? Backwards and right. I think he'll go forwards. For the better scatters. Oh, okay. Like tackles on it, right? Tackles ones on it. Three amazing ones, there we go. He can jump here, though, with his edge one. His edge one can, like, go one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven. You can't jump quite though, can you? Eight, nine, ten. No, you should just dodge in the front and then jump out. Dodging so in the dodge front. Dodging between. Fuck. Oh, like up here, yeah, yeah. okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Dodge in there. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. One. We'll pick up the ball, one, two, jump three, over four, and five, hand it off to the thrower. Six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, yeah, okay, that yeah. works, doesn't it? And then he passes it to him. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I can run all the way around. Oh, just... Shadowing. Yeah, this is better at running all the way around him, too. Yeah. Don't use it. Yeah. You do use that one. Yeah. Roll to one. Reroll. Yep. <laughs> he burnt his five on the shadowing. Leap. Mm. Well, right, jump. Is this a two plus jump? It is as well, isn't um, it? So oh, it's no, one, no. two, three. three. Three plus jump. Three oh, plus you can't jump. Because he's got minus two jump. there. So that's sort of like you do minus two, right? Gets it. Dodge, hand up. Dodge, hand up, yeah. Two plus, two plus, two plus. Two, 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 two. Makes the six, four. Oh, it doesn't hand it off. Oh, what? What? Do mm. the pass. What the? What the flip? Is he doing a pass? Is that a pass action? No, no, it was a hand off action. He just, just didn't do the hand off. He wants the catcher. Weird. Catch has got dodge. It was a bit weird. I guess he like he changed his mind and he wants to just stall out this half and then make it one one <laughs> and win in overtime. Because if he'd scored, like, you know, next turn he just loses two one, doesn't he? He can chain he can chain the diving tackle onto the ball like without blitzing here. He just needs to feel the three squares on the left hand side of the wrestler. And then hit with the witch and then chain the diving tackle onto the ball. And this one, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah that's not bad. No, it didn't do it. Cars. Hi ya! Yo! Wow, it's funny that this guy just does whatever he wants. <laughs> Movement nine. Add one plus. L. L. Basically, a good runner. Yeah. 
Not hitting the ball though. Oh, wow, not even the ball. <laughs> Just faith in diving tackle, I guess. Yeah. Eilish is safe for his bit, you know, he doesn't use any rerolls now, he just keeps his four rerolls for overtime, I guess. Yeah, but now you just blitz through the witch and then dodge out on the free two. Like, yeah. so you don't have to dodge off diving tackle. Yeah, that I was weird. I don't like the base. No, I don't like the base yeah. at all. I'd rather like Even base here. I'd rather base the three. Yeah, yeah, that's where I thought he was going. That's where I thought he was going, Bosh. Big Kev is favoured in overtime, isn't he? Because he's just going to keep beating him up, probably. Yeah, Wizard's gone now. It's, it's cooked. Yeah. There you go. Flips through. Don't give a shit. Where you side set to? I'm just going to 2 2 out. Oh, how? Dodge this. Wow. <laughs> I guess his thinking was, um, yeah, this has got tackle, but yeah, that was weird from Big Cat, I would say. Yeah, uh, just gave him an out. Blodge Tato. Glorious Blodge Tato. we got two dodges left. Yeah. I mean, Bright's still nearly out of players, whereas I think Kepo's still a massive favourite. Yeah, me? yeah, for sure. This was his wizard shot, wasn't it? But but Bright will have the one turn at the end, right? Uh, so, well, if he's got any players left, yeah. He yeah. Will. So it's still in. It's still super interesting, but he is down to two rerolls. I mean, I wouldn't say Kefog's a massive hit because it's still likely to end two-two. Um, at the end of a sixteen turns, yeah. But yeah, Kefog's kind of got the inevitability with having AV eight versus AV, well AV nine plus versus AV eight plus. And he's got like the diving tackle, hasn't he? And the shadowing. Yeah. Like he's got the two cheeky little things that help versus other elves. I know Sharon doesn't really count, but the diving tackle's nice. The shadowing's doing something here though. Yeah, you don't wanna you don't wanna keep moving because he's getting closer to the ball. Yeah. And just call it there, let him get punched and die. Mm. So it's five plus for elves to shadow, is, that, is, that, is it to do with a movement? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's like, I think you need a six and then you add the difference in movement. So like he's moved seven oh, versus so six. Plus one because it's so, oh, okay. That's what I think. I know it got nerfed but I don't really know how. <laughs> I don't care that much about shadowing. <laughs> yeah, but... I'm still in. I think the, the whole purpose of shadowing is just to have a bad skill. So if you rando general, like because yes. the voice general is like really good to rando, isn't it? So yeah. You need you need a crap skill in there just to discourage it. Yeah. Oh, I used pro. You rerolled. You rerolled the rush with pro. Disgusting. Yeah. So now he's gonna go for the uh, the tackle witch, isn't he? Three two. Three two. 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 Let's go. Three, two, two, two. Waiting for a pony. Oh. Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, you've got to reroll it when it's just the two. 
Gets him. Does he Armor break? break? Does he break? G -G? This is huge yeah, if he breaks AV. Oh, does. 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 Oh does my break god. Does it break AV? Sorry. Ball, <laughs> yeah, he does get the, <laughs> does get the pick it up. Or maybe he doesn't get the pick it up, it oh, might scatter out of range. It. Oh my oh. god, it does! Oh no, can he? It scatters out of range. Oh my goodness. Oh no, that side step you can get it funny. That blitz are. That blitz is uh, bright. Yeah, yeah, he can score. Yeah. Oh, what you mean it's out of yeah, range, range, range of the paper, witch, yeah. otherwise the witch could have just gone and picked it up, oh. right? If it had gone anywhere else, basically, six out of eight, the witch elf gets it. Or if it scatters to him, he catches it. But it ended up like the only way the witch couldn't get it was by scattering onto him and then further away. Or onto him and further away. Um, obviously, if it goes in the crowd, he could have recovered it with somebody. But this one can just go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, <laughs> or this one. He can blitz, actually, can't he? he? This one can dodge. And he's got tackle and diving tackle. Maybe uh, the catcher blitzes. <sighs> no, just decides oh I God. can't roll ones, and then rolls double ones. You snake that. Yeah, he had to. He's got dodge. He? That's GG. The Dubai ones. GG. That is probably GG. Yeah. <coughs> yep. Yeah. No, 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 I'm not okay a bad boy. But, I mean, <laughs> but uh, that looks like uh, we can end the YouTube video here. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. How how dare you, Dimmy? Um... <laughs> There's still there's still lots of adverts for people to watch, you know. <laughs> don't don't deny me my uh, my tenth yeah. of a cent here, Dimmy. <laughs> Any anyone watching this now, Kafo's actually won Chalice already, though. We we know this. No, that's not just, true. That's not true. He won the ladder, so he's already qualified. He is already qualified, yeah. so I don't know who was second in the ladder. Let's go to Nuffle X Y Z and find out. Hello, Squirrel. Hello. Because the, both of these have qualified, right? So. Uh, yeah. So what we can do is we can find the season five ladder. Mad Jake, I think. Had Mad Jake qualified or not? Let's look at the World Cup qualifiers. I don't think so. No. So Mad Jake is now qualified from the ladder. Wow. Mm. Regardless of who wins anyway, because they they both already qualified. Very exciting. Run it once. Yeah. Do you uh, blitz the scoring for it and just pray that I don't know. <laughs> pray for divine intervention. <laughs> <laughs> maybe don't blitz the. Maybe just mark the scoring threat and then hope that no, don't don't yet. Yeah, just leave the scoring threat and hope he double ones the catch. I guess uh -huh. is just put him next to him. Put a player next to him so you can pick it up after he fails the catch. I don't know. I don't know what you do here. I don't even. This know is cooked. Do. This is cooked. Yes. Yeah. He's up. He's up shit creek without a paddle. Is what he is. He hasn't even got a bloody raft, mate. No. Not just he's a floater. Big Kev, I wonder if Big Kev's gonna win Chalice. He won it. He won it in Blood Bowl too, didn't he? And now really good the... team. Yeah. Really good team. Did he win it? With, he won it with Woodies, didn't he? He did. Yeah, he had a natty, didn't he? He had a disgusting natty. Um, but I got the pile on twice the in the semi-final and uh, did not kill it. Did he play Mankies in the final? Uh, I don't know. He played Chaos in the final. I don't know who the coach so. was, but I, I knew he played Chaos, because that, that's why I didn't really mind that I'd lost in the semi, because I thought I wasn't going to win the final right against Chaos as Dwarves. Um, whereas obviously Wood Elves, it's kind of easy for them against Chaos a little bit. You know, like a tackle. Win challenge, Jim. 
Did I win? Yeah. Too soon, Dimmy. Oh, I didn't. You know I didn't. Oh, you I didn't know if you won a different one. I know you lost to Norse. Yeah, that was the only final I made. Ah. Uh, I made like you got, three you semis. Had the, high, the high elves. So you got to the semi, right? Yeah. Um, the and then the Rome. Chaos Dwarf semi. The Chaos Dwarfs got the final against the Norse. Um, did you do Chaos Dwarfs twice? No, no, just once. Ch Chaos Dwarfs once got the final. Um, Chaos lost in the semi to Inarion. Um, Dw Roller Dwarves lost in the semi versus Kfog. And High Elves lost in the semi versus somebody with rats. I forget the coach. Chanta? No, I know it wasn't Chanta. It was it was somebody who had like two Edge 5. No, he had an Edge 5 good runner and an Edge 6 good runner. So, oh. So that was nice. Uh, Honestly, I probably should just yeah. banged it in on offense and then gone on defense because, like, my defense crushed him. And then, so I, you know, probably tactically inept. That game. Oh, he gets the ball. Gets the ball. Is he going to pass it over heads to this guy? He is. Oh my god, how have you done this? Gets him. Unfortunately he's not in range because this guy got stunned and this guy was stunned, so he can run away. He's just a skillless lineman. With a dream. Yeah, he can run over run over here. Pretty easy, yep. All screw. Yeah, my high L's was ended by the Edge. Edge 5 and Edge 6 uh, cutters. And I just tried to like stall on my drive, but I, and looking back, I shouldn't have. It's funny, I nearly lost the first round with those high L's. I played Rick, didn't I? And, like, he, he dub skulled or quad skulled. He either dub wand or he quad skulled. And if he hadn't done that, I, would, I was really close to him just winning, not even wizarding, right? I think I like played around the wizard. But that just made it too easy for his fucking frogs to come in and hit me. And I think they got the ball and then like double on the dodge away. Oh, you played against Kislev? Yeah, yeah, it was Rick's Kislev. Yeah, I was really close to losing that in the first round. Really close. Was that when he had the strength one catcher? <laughs> Maybe, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, that was hilarious. Yeah, he had two edge five, yeah. So Rick was a very dangerous game in that round. And, uh,. And obviously there was the Cruise game, which was glorious, and uh, the Elliot game, which was glorious for one of us. Mate, Kislev, like Kislev were lethal when they had one reroll per turn. Like imagine what they're like now with multiple rerolls per turn. Yeah, it's, it's vanity. Yeah. Oh, he got him! What a surprise! Yeah. Doesn't catch the bounce. Mate, honestly, it feels like the ball lands on someone way more often than in real life. <laughs> like, whenever you sack someone, it always feels like someone's catching it or it's landing on someone. Probably just because you see more, isn't it? It's the simplest thing, yeah. explanation. See more. Yeah. Mm. It's the thing with like all the poker things, isn't it? You know, everyone says like, "Oh, it's way more, way more bad beats online." It's just because you see me way more hands. It's like that, and that's the way it is. You can try the three-two here. Okay, it goes for the five. <laughs> that was fair enough. I don't hate going for the three-two though. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then you could GFI, right? You could you could three-two GFI, and then. You, you can't even dodge in one deep how you <laughs> which isn't great for him but it's better than not doing it isn't it but I guess ultimately this was his scoring threat wasn't it like he would one deep how you then this guy would get the ball to him I guess is the idea
thought I made a more of a game out of this than I thought it was going to be after the. Uh... Yeah, he did well, didn't he? Battle, never give up. Never give up. Give up sometimes. Must be a John Cena fan and not a Tony Plays Pooley fan. <laughs> yeah. Artemis is definitely a Tony Plays Pooley fan. <laughs> yeah. Well, no, not even that. He's took it to the next level. It's like give up every time. <laughs> yeah, give up every time. Yeah, always give up. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I double won the rush. Oh, my goodness. Oh, man. Outplayed. Mm. Outrolled. Yeah. That was great on Fumble. Uh, Bill Brasky always wrote well rolled <laughs> instead of well played. <laughs> <laughs> after, he, after he lost, you know, well rolled. That's toxic. Toxic. That is pretty toxic. I mean, again, I don't, I don't know what toxic means. Does just toxic mean things I don't like? Uh, yeah, basically. Which I thought it meant like toxic, not, <laughs> not just does things, things I don't things like. That, things that will kill you. Yeah. Well, I don't like that. I don't like that, honestly. Again, I would like a little bit safer, right? Like this, he does get the surf. This one doing it his way, but I would have got, gone up there and then block this one and then move that guy up here. Well, I guess you just don't need to. It doesn't matter, does it? Yeah, it's pretty, pretty. It's all six and two threes, I guess. But it's interesting that I wouldn't have done the same as Big Kev. I just dodges him. Okay, fair enough then. Fair enough. He just dodged him there. In that case, fair, completely reasonable. I find it interesting, you know, when, uh, like, you know, just find it interesting when somebody does something different. It doesn't mean that it's, you know, either of us are wrong, does it? At the end of the day, like, who knows? One of us will be wrong. <laughs> and it, one of us could be wrong by quite a way. Like, you just don't know, do you? We, we don't have the, uh, we don't have Blood Bowl stockfish. If we did, you know... K-Fog's move might have given him a 98% chance to win and my move might have only been 92% or it could be 98 and 97.9 or 98 and 99 like just we've got no idea have we at the end of the day like what the best squares are and what the best dodges are and what the best blocks are and all that you've got to do what you think so but it's interesting that it's not always the same is it like a, a lot of the time it's the same uh, with like you know how to sack the ball and stuff like you know put the guard in there go around and do that but when it's stuff like protecting the ball like this so I find it somewhat interesting when people do different things and, uh, yeah like toxic it's like it feels to me it feels worse than just says something you don't like do you know what I mean like <laughs> like to no. me toxic implies like do you know what I mean like a concerted long term um, you know like e malicious intent Rather than just malicious right. intent, that's what I would say toxic implies to me, whether rightly or wrongly, that's what I think. And I've never had malicious intent, but I can see that I've never. said things that never, but I can You've see never that. had malicious intent. No, I haven't, not, 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 not Blood Bowl streaming wise, absolutely not, no. Oh, right, okay, I, I thought you just meant in your life in general. Well, in my life, I have, but in Blood Bowl streaming, I haven't, you know, yeah. But, but I'm sure I've obviously I've said things that people didn't like and stuff. Um, but I've never yeah, I've never does. meant to be I've never meant to be an arsehole. It just comes naturally to me. <laughs> I mean no but nobody well, I guess. Yeah, some, some people do. do I mean, yeah. Some people do mean to be, don't they? <laughs> Hello, cock. Hey, Hancock. Hey. Bosh. Bish, bosh, bash. I really wish the Dark Elf models were better. Hmm. You can't make them better with the customizations. They've all got like dildo hats. So <laughs> it's, it's just weird. <laughs> You can you can make them better with customizations, but obviously, hey. Big Kev didn't. <laughs> yeah.
<laughs> yeah, I think it's probably best, honestly. In game chat was a load of nonsense, mate. Like, honestly. Yeah. Like, you're just playing a game of football. Like, if, if you want to chat to someone, like, you just play your mate and have a chat on Discord, don't you? Like, you yeah. don't want to chat to some random person in the ladder. Yeah, and lots of leagues have got, like, chat rooms and stuff, right? And then people, yeah, people will chat if they play in a private league. But, um... Yeah, the... I mean, like, even when I play tabletop, I don't chat to my opponent because we haven't got flipping time. It's just yeah. like, right, 2D block here, 2D block here, 2D block here. Like, how's Vanessa? Do you know what I mean? <laughs> 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 you, know what I mean? Like, you don't have time for that shit. <laughs> Um, yeah, it's funny on the Blood Bowl 3 Discord how many people are just like tagging their previous opponents saying you lucky bastard and stuff. Like, you know, like, <laughs> every time that happens makes me not miss chat, I'll be honest. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. You could just disable it. You could just mute it if you wanted, yeah. To be fair, and I, I muted it and that was it. Um, and then unmuted it if I played somebody I might want to talk to if I remembered. For me, I didn't mind it. It was just that... With streaming, I just like I often just forgot to say hello to people and stuff because it's hard to do all you know all things at once. But um, there you go. <laughs> Hashtag lucky bastard. Hello, K Fog. Yep, that was. It was funny, wasn't it? Bright, bright. Knowing that his guy was Edge One Plus meant that the jump was a still a two plus even as an attack as well. Because me and Dimmy were like, he should dodge out and then jump. But of course, you know we hadn't played. 40 games that team or whatever and just missed that he was at one plus so he's like no no the jump's just better and then oh no diving tackle whoopsie <laughs> whoopsie and then uh there was the dub one yeah, i didn't even know diving tackle worked on a the jump there you go maybe right didn't yeah the catch was incredible amazing team i thought amazing team that he made like you know to get such a good team and be getting that and to have such a good team have that player and a wizard is was crazy. So I, I had him as favourite to be honest. But um, yeah, the diving tackle and dice with a with a killer, and obviously lots of positional play as well. So there you go. Congratulations, K Fog. Commiserations, Bright. Thank you, Dimmy. Glorious having you in the booth. Yeah, I think everyone should tag Jimmy when they get diced in a game. <laughs> no, they shouldn't. And thanks for watching, everybody. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>